I'm Damian Josephsberg from Equip, and today we're going to be talking about steam turbine internal alignment. Now, there are three basic kinds of steam turbine internal alignment that we perform. The first is tops off. That's when we set up a laser and shoot it through the turbine and measure all of the internal points, whether it be diaphragms or blade rings. We, pet, we measure all of the packing sections. And that's all we do is we take the tops off readings only. Um, we can account for some out of roundness and we can account for some horizontal joint deflection. We account for any kind of a rotor sag and we only take the tops off readings. This is good for uh, very small turbines shorter turbines, um, and it's better than certainly not performing any alignment. Uh, then the next kind of alignment that we perform is going to be a tops on, tops off alignment. This is when we physically measure the turbine with the top on it. Then we also take a set of readings with the top off the turbine. We calculate the deviation from the tops on readings to the tops off readings so that we know what that change is when the top goes on to the top being off. We take all of our readings to do all of our moves with the top off the turbine. While we're doing that, we're able to make all of our adjustments more easily since the top is off and we can always calculate for the top being back on with that initial top on to top off deviation. This type of alignment is the best kind to do for a steam turbine and it's the only kind that you can do for a gas turbine. Um, this is essential if you absolutely need to know the exact deviation if you have very tight clearances or um, if you have a newer style turbine where the shell may be a little bit more flimsy and so it's going to warp a little bit as the top gets bolted on. Um, it's also very important if you have very tight clearances for all of the internal components. The next type of alignment that we're going to talk about is an express alignment. Another good name for an express alignment is a theoretical tops on alignment. Because what we're going to do in this type of alignment is only take tops off readings, but we're going to calculate the outer roundness. We're going to calculate the horizontal joint deviation. We're going to take actual rub measurements on any of the diaphragms and any any sort of the pack, all the packing that's in, and uh, any of the seal strips. And we're going to calculate where the turbine was running with the top on, without actually putting the top on. This sort of approach. Um, is very good if you don't have the amount of time to perform a tops on tops off. So you get a lot of the same benefits of a tops on, however, you don't have to spend the time to actually put the top on. Thank you very much for listening to Steam Turbine Internal Alignment. I'm Damian Josephsberg. I'll see you next time.